The reality here for so many people is that this has been a long year of scraping and patching and just trying to make it to the next month. But there have been some protections in place, uh, eviction moratoriums, bars up to foreclosures of homes. And just because uh, we're coming to the end of this, it doesn't mean that people have money to pay those bills that are still out there. Right. Casey, that's exactly right. And workers that we've talked to in the city are grateful for that check that's coming in from the stimulus package. But the word that they've been using is kind of calling it a Band-Aid solution. Right. And the vice president coming into Las Vegas today, meeting with some union workers, meeting them at the Culinary Academy. And some of those local folks tell me that they plan to bring those concerns to the vice president, you know, talking about the sustainability of these solutions. These are short term is what one worker told me. We met a woman named Mary Ann. This weekend, who used to be a buffet worker at the Strat Casino and Hotel, and she hasn't been back to work in almost an entire year. And some of that stuff, Casey, is affecting these union contracts. So it means that after one year, she might not have a job at all. Take a listen to what, to what she told us this weekend. There's still a lot of people that they laid off for almost a year now that they have been called not even one day. So that means in March, 17 for those people having been called to back to work even one day were automatically terminated and for me that's not fair i love my job i'm not a lazy person i i appreciate the help from the government don't get me wrong like what i said little thing helps you know i really appreciate but those are short term Casey, those are short term solutions like you heard Marianne say there. You know, she's grateful for this money coming in, but she calls it money already spent for her. It's going towards her car payments, which are already overdue. And she needs that car to drive to the food pantry in order to feed her family and her neighbors. So the long term solutions here still very much question marks around all of it. In the meantime, it's a lot of stress and anxiety for many workers here in Las Vegas. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. You should know that you can follow today's top stories and breaking news and catch up on your favorite MSNBC shows all in one place. Download the NBC News app today.